everyone, it's Kelly here and happy Labor Day. I did a Labor Day haul um, shopping here and today was the last day to actually use my coupon for Joann's and Joann's had a really good deal going on with some beads. It's like some of them that you see here are buy one get one free and then also buy two get one free. So I totally took advantage of the sale that was going on this weekend and also today which is Monday the last day. So I also had like a 50% off coupon and then they also accept competitors coupons such as you know Michael's and Michael's has the 25% off entire regular purchase so I was able to use that at Joann's and I was extremely happy that they had um, taken that you know I had it in my purse and I busted it out and I was like yay I could definitely use it and they were like yeah so I pretty much used it for these three packs here that I got and these were already inexpensive and turns out that after the uh, fifty percent off for one pack, and then these two here were twenty five percent off as well as another twenty five percent off. I think it was like it came out to be like a dollar something, and these are such a good buy because like it comes in a variety of different colors and um they 're really heavy they are glass beads actually, and I am just extremely happy with this buy. I pretty much purchased as you can see nothing but beads and beads caps for the purpose of making you know stick pens and I have fell, fallen in love with making stick pens so this is a stick pen that I had made using Wild Orchid Crafts hat pen that I had received in my DT package and I haven't actually um, glued this together yet I just wanted to see how it looks like so I just like you know added um, tape here for it to so that it doesn't run out here and um, I had made one right here for uh, my Moulin Rouge mini album. As you can see, the colors here coordinate really well. And so today I definitely took advantage of their sale and got more supplies to make some stick pens. And I am just extremely happy to have found this actually. Um, I ordered this before from uh, somebody on Etsy. And, you know, I didn't get as much as this, and this was actually uh, pretty pretty cheap, you know, mainly because of the sale that was going on. It was like two for, actually you buy two and then you get one free. So I got one in the gold, and then it comes in like, you know, three different sizes, 120 pieces here, as you can see. And such a great deal, 120, and then like I got one for free. So I ended up getting this for free here, which is another bead cap here, a flower bead cap in, with a silver antique look to it. And I purchased the silver one here. You know, it's a it's the same as the gold one. So I opened that up, and I wanted to show you guys exactly the how it looks like and the different sizes. So pretty much, um, that's like the larger one for your larger bead, your medium one here, and a smaller one here just like that. So I used it here, you know, just to see how it looked like. Kind of put it all together. And then this here I also got, which was buy two, get one free, and it was actually this here. This is a different brand, and then this one I bought, and then these are another different type of um, bead cap here. So definitely a great buy. And then this one was buy one, get one free. It's like a, you know, circular bead here with the filigree so a bigger version of this actually and then I had purchased this here which was buy to get one free as well and this is like a silver antique finish here it looks like a little cup so I can definitely use it with like these pins right here you know and um, it would look definitely amazing like a vintage looking um, stick pen design. So that's what I plan to do. And these were buy one, get one free. These gorgeous glass beads here by um, Bliss Beads. So they were like $3.99. So I bought two and then I ended up having um, two of them for free. And these were buy two, get one free as well. So such a great deal today. And the last day I believe that they're offering this. Extremely, I was extremely happy to have gotten this because I love making stick pens now. At first I didn't know what they were used for. <laughs> you know, I, I saw them in like 
being incorporated into like different projects and stuff. And I thought they were like the cutest thing ever. So I figured, um, you know, you could definitely make one on your own and it's super easy. Like all you really need to do is just use like glossy accents to glue it or even like, you know, the glue from your um, glue gun, just a thin film, just to glue it, you know, and then like so that the beads will stick. And I just love incorporating it into like my projects, just like my latest project here. It has the stick pen, the Wild Earthcraft stick pen, and just added some coordinating beads, coordinating colored beads to it. So I just love the way that looks. And then I even like had added it onto, um, you know, my tag here that I had made. So that, and I also added onto um, some clutches, you know, that I had made previously as well. So definitely they can be used for a lot of your scrapbooking embellishments for some of us that are new to scrapbooking and don't really know what the purpose of it is. It's just another embellishment that, you know, I had actually learned to love and love to make now. <laughs> so I'm going to be making a lot and I will show you guys what I come up with. So make sure you stay tuned. And then I am so happy to actually, um, you know, have this to make so I could send it off to my friends as well as racks and stuff. And I cannot wait to actually share with them my creation. It's super fun and super fast to make. So, you know, definitely I will get that out to my friends. <laughs> so stay tuned and um, watch what I come up with. I will definitely bust out with a lot of them and show you guys how they look like. All right. Thanks for tuning in. Go out and get some of your own. Um, you still have time to shop if you guys are... Um, well, actually, it's Monday, Liber Day, so I think maybe Joanne's is still open. <laughs> but good luck on that, and um, thanks for watching. Bye.